Oh, are you okay? Rip the booty. So getting around by car in New York is like the worst thing ever. So John lent us his electric scooter to get from A to B. And apparently it's like 10 times as fast. And, and I'm cool with this because one, I don't have to push. Two, it's faster. And three, I get to leave my scooter at John's house. So I don't have to like take on my back or anything. All I got's my bag. This is great. found John. We also got this guy with us. This dude, look at his smile. Yeah, where are we going anyway? I have no idea. The Globe. Meet up at this one big skate park and there's a bunch of spots around there and traffic and more traffic. You got insurance? Um, no. <laughs> Alright, let's do it. Following you, I don't know where the heck to go. Today we're gonna to be playing follow the leader with John. Pretty much my entire point of the day is trying to keep up with this guy because it's so much, because there's so much going on all the time. Nope, not going that way. Should we for Coda? Yeah! I see a smoke trying to break with all this weight. <laughs> I know, dude. Coda's riding around with this giant douchebag, which that's, a, that's actually what it's called, <laughs> just so we're all clear on that. Dude, I grabbed onto the Chinese guy's bike like you did, and he let me go. I don't think he knew that was on the back, but he still let me go. All well, the photo shoot's going down, boy. Coda's been following us with this giant bag. I don't know how he's, like, keeping up. I think it's 50 pounds. 50 pounds? Let me see. Oh, that's not, that's not terrible. I, th I thought it was going to be way worse than that, though. One curl. I mean, it's... Huh? One curl. Wow, I'm riding? Oh God! <laughs> oh my God! Double green, it's a five pointer, bud. Woo! Dude, I'm doing all right so far. Now we're safe. I'm doing okay. One time I got nervous right there. One time is when that guy like, I think he slammed on his brakes when we were like right next to him. It freaked me out a little bit. You can't really get hit by a car over there. Oh, but yeah, you can. But if, if you're like dodging the right way like you are, because I'm used to uh, just following you through the city, it works out. We do just fine. We both get to keep our faces and our scooters intact. Okay, double it, double it now. Double heel. Me first or you first? Yes, mate. Yes. Got one. Get up there, get up there. Did you hear my scoot crying? One piece? One piece, we're good. Okay, so we made it out here to Chelsea Skate Park. This is in Manhattan. Park looks pretty cool. There's a couple like really weird obstacles like this. It's like a bank into like a curved pool coping thing. We're gonna hang here for like an hour. So I'm definitely gonna be trying to get a few clips here because I've never ridden the skate park. And it's really cool to see like a full skate park with some transition in New York because I don't really see that that often. So this should be a good time. All right, so first line is gonna be on this hip and then transferring over to this one over here. Quit standing around and follow me. Oh, Jesus, all right, cool, jeez, we. Oh, Every time I land, it's like, it sounds like it's barfing. I wanna see an invert on this first hip and then I saw you do it earlier on that one, whip you run double, or heel you run double. Quad. I just did. You did? Yeah. Film it? Yeah, it was behind you. Oh, all right, so five whip, because I was trying it. Oh, goodness, all so right. I want to see you do it. Just like a nice Superman. You don't feel like fat, but just like hold it. Hold Ned. Someone's calling me. Just forget about him. Now here we run double. Yes, mate. Hopefully I got that. <laughs> Quint, then Superman. Ooh, that's a tough one. Is this the biggest park in New York? Like biggest ramps and everything? Yeah. Okay, cool. Yeah, like that ramp will slow you down so much. Yeah, it's true. You and make you think that like it doesn't work, but it does. Or that you suck. Or that you suck. Yeah, yeah. All right, Black, this one's for you right now. I'm gonna get it for you right now. And you gotta get my back with your double. Right now, right now, come on. 
Oh, are you okay? Rip the booty. That's a cool box. I want to do that. Yo! Yo! Yes, baby. I'm talking about. Thank you, thank you, thank yeah, you. Yeah, yeah. Thank you for the encouragement. Thank you for pushing me. Thank you for making it happen. Yeah. My man, you killed it. <laughs> yes. Time for triple. Let's go. Ah. <laughs> Cruising over, grab something to eat really quick. I'm starving. Can I get a ham and cheese sandwich, please? Awesome. Thank you. Jump over the way, jump, jump on, jump on, jump on. Yo, I'm pretty proud of myself so far. I'm doing pretty good. I'm keeping up, you know what I'm saying? That's what I'm talking about, baby. This follow the leader challenge is not turning out to be so bad on my end. But I am nervous, I'll tell you that. Yeah, yeah. Just made it out here to Times Square. Love this spot. Come here about once a year. Usually, may, sometimes, maybe twice. I think I've been here in the past year. I like this spot, although it's extremely busy all the time. Again, again. <laughs> really? Yes, mate. That dude watched my channel. <laughs> I know, dude. I got you. I'm second. You spooked her on that one, dude. That was bad. I'm not going to that. It's already been a massive day. Huge shout out to John for leading the way because God knows that if I would have been the one in front, we both would have died. But we made it out, we made it out just fine. He's a great leader. So if you guys ever come to New York and you wanna cruise the streets of NYC, call this dude. Cause going on your own, it's freaking sketch. I had to do it twice cause I got lost. But I kept up, so I'm proud of myself. I did not think I was gonna happen cause last time I was way too afraid to go as fast as he was and to like squeeze the extremely tight small spots that there are like between a UPS truck and a taxi, it's freaking scary. Oh my gosh, it's been a very, very long day and for some odd reason, my neck has been absolutely killing me for the past like probably about 10 hours now, but we made it through the day just fine, no problems like I said earlier. One thing I'm actually pretty excited about this trip um, is the fact that I'm gonna be out here on September 11th uh, here in New York and I talked to John a little bit today and I'm gonna try to make it over to the memorial on the 11th because I want to see what it's like and I want to kind of be in that uh, in that area and somewhat experiencing the the vibe that it gives off while I'm over there. Everybody should know 9-11, um, the massive terrorist attack that happened on the Twin Towers, but that's something I'm really, really excited about to be here for. I've been to the memorial one time previously, but it's going to be so much different actually being there. What has it been? Wow, it has been. It's been 18 years since the 9-11 attack. So I would have been nine years old and I think I was in fourth grade at the time I believe I was in fourth grade and I remember I, I, I didn't go to school for a little bit that was a crazy day but I'm also gonna be riding a lot with John at different street spots throughout the city I do have a couple other ideas that I want to do with John that I want to utilize I have like a little competition slash game thing that I want to do with him that I haven't actually seen yet on YouTube when it comes to scootering so that's gonna be really interesting and on the 13th I'm gonna be going over to Illinois my family lives in Marion Illinois so I'm gonna try to get to a couple skate parks while I'm out there there, but I'm not really focusing too much on the riding aspect while I'm out there. I'm filming a whole bunch of videos while I'm here. So when I do go to Illinois, I can kind of just hang out with my family and spend time with him because I haven't seen my dad and my stepmom or my little half sister in, I believe, like three, two, two years now. I saw my brother not that long ago, so that was cool, but I haven't seen anybody else in a long time, so it'll be cool to be able to catch up with them. It is currently 1.45 a.m. I'm just finishing editing, and I'm gonna be calling it a night here very soon, but I wanna say thank you guys so much for watching the videos. The channel's been blowing up lately. You guys have been awesome, and hopefully you guys enjoy the next few videos that I have here in New York with John Reyes. So thank you guys so much again for watching today's Follow the Leader Challenge, and until next time, I'm out of here. Later.